what's up y'all what it do welcome back to my channel i am your girl tina baba i am your host tina baba what's up what's happening how y'all doing what it is don't oh what's up can tina baba get some love and that's a no okay that's just that on that y'all what's up as y'all can see as y'all can tell your girl your girl is going through a wednesday adams phase and i go through a wednesday adams phase at least three three months out of the year so if you new around here and true around here you already know that but to all the newbies yes i love me some wednesday adams and y'all mean to tell me y'all done made wednesday in 2022 y'all done put wednesday adams in 2022 not only that it's on netflix not only that, the writers who wrote Wednesday Adams said they got four, three more because they wrote four. They wrote four seasons of Wednesday Adams so that they can slowly introduce the rest of the characters. Now, I'm not going to say anything in this particular video to ruin Wednesday for y'all because I know a lot of people haven't gotten the time off from work yet. Y'all ain't had the time to sit down and watch Wednesday yet. But y'all know I probably don't watch it like twice. <laughs> I don't watch it twice because it's going on three times. Y'all, it's so dang gone good. Speaking of it being so good, my little girl gonna ask me, should she watch Wednesday? Mm-mm. Mm -mm. I told her no. You know why I told her no? I told her no because first of all, when I tried to get y'all to watch the Adams Family, y'all did not want to watch the Adams Family. Da da da. And so if you don't, if you haven't watched the Adams Family, why is you trying to watch Wednesday? You don't even know where she come from. You don't even know what this about. Now let me say this: Can you watch Wednesday without watching the Adams Family? Yeah, you can watch it, but then you just gonna know Wednesday. So just like the title of the Netflix series, it's just gonna be like it's about Wednesday. So you just gonna know Wednesday. You know she got a mom and a daddy and a brother but you ain't really gonna know all the details for real for real so that's why i told her not to like watch it because she ain't watched the adam's family but if you just really just want to watch wednesday and just get that little snippet out of it it is good so they have one season up on netflix which is about eight episodes and then so they have three more seasons already written let's go <laughs> let's go once a month january the next wednesday february the next wednesday march the next wednesday and if if we watching it keep making it that's how i feel about it that's how i feel it should go if we watching it if it's staying in the top 10 longer than 30 days out of all the days it's up then it definitely should get a stay i'm so glad they brought wednesday adam back for 2022 like they blessing my little spirit i love that they did scream in 2022 they did something else like, I'm loving all these Halloween, even though my... Oh. Did I tell y'all? R.I.P. Mac. R.I.P. Okay, he, he gone this time for real, y'all. For real. For real. So, yeah, Michael died, but we had our last Halloween in, in 2022. Actually, 2022 was, was, was pretty good for me. I ain't gonna lie. Like, on the movie... Now, I see people who be watching movies all the time. Like, y'all be like, I watch this on Netflix. At this point, y'all watch anything. If y'all watch that troll shit, you legit watch anything. Like, how much time do you actually have for TV if you will pick a movie like that and then indulge in it? I ain't got that much time. TV time? Yeah, I ain't got that much time just to be... No, I ain't even finna waste. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. I don't even want to feel like that. I don't even want to feel like I waste that much of a portion of my life watching it a wednesday is definitely good so how y'all been how y'all been how life been treating y'all life still good still eating good still getting the eight good I, I, I. as you should as you should as you should y'all know what i cannot i cannot get a hold of like my mind would not i just be like what be going on because why on the done dishwashing liquid commercials why they be washing everything but the damn dishes why the hell do they be washing ducks like i just have like that's my that's that's my oh why the hell y'all always washing these ducks and why the hell do the ducks always got oil on them two questions two so comments box open wide open y'all let me know because i'll be like what done and i use done so that's why it's like that like i use done it's one of my favorites i would say 
Why the hell y'all always washing ducks? That's not how you gonna sell your shit. Cause why people be using palm olive? Did palm olive used to be a soap? I just don't like palm olive. I ain't even gonna keep you. I don't like palm olive. And it, I think it's cause it's orange. And I don't know, I got a disdain for orange. You know what else I don't like? Gain dishwashing liquid. The washing powder, you good people. I bangs with you a little bit. But the dishwashing liquid, why did y'all make dishwashing liquid? I just don't like that. I don't like the look of it. I don't like, uh-uh. It's just not my thing. But I use done. And I always, I want to know, why the hell they be having these ducks? Why do they wash ducks instead of dishes in the damn commercials? And then on today, I'm going to answer a question that I was asked I really don't know why y'all be wanting to ask me questions. And I told y'all don't ask me questions. Y'all still ask me questions. I don't know what that is. Do y'all just like me? Y'all like my country ass voice. Y'all be making fun of me on the low. And I don't even care because I don't really care about y'all. So I'm going to just let y'all talk about me on the low. But I'm going to answer your question. Because I told y'all don't ask me no question. Because y'all like Tina let me. Y'all like Tina. You should start a relationship segment. How? Bitch. How, why the fuck, how the fuck, how I'm going to start a relationship segment, I ain't got no ship I'm selling on. What is you talking about? Like, women don't make no sense. Why do y'all want relationship advice from your single friend? Bitch, I got no advice. All advice I have is to leave. I did never, I have nothing else. I have nothing else but to tell you to leave. But y'all want Tina Bopper to be a relationship guru so goddamn bad. Okay, so here we go. She didn't me this question and I guess she really, 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 really wanted me to answer this. So, here we go. She said, can a relationship go back to exactly how it was after the partner cheats? No, never. Never, ever. No. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. You can try. Mm-mm. Mm -mm. You just gonna be mellowing in it until it explodes. It can never go back to the way it was. Was two healthy, loving adults that loved and cared for each other and was all about each other. And then once one party cheats, therefore letting this party know that this person isn't happy. And not, it could not only be happiness. Whatever this person is seeking, this person, it starts a train wreck of emotions and it never go back the same. It's kind of like if you put too much salt in your food and then you try to add water to dilute it or you can eat it that way. You can eat it real salty, but it'll never be the same. It'll just be you'll be eating salty food, extra salty food. Or you'll be eating tasteless, watery food because you added too much water to it. But to answer the question, it will never be the same. It'll never be the same. And most people throw it away. So it's the same way. It's just like that for me. That's how Tina Bob advice. I can't give you nobody else's point of view. I can't get nobody else. I mean, I could. But in this intimate, I, I'm not because you didn't ask for nobody else's. And I'm sure you done had advice from the people you know, your mother and all the people, your friends, you know, associates and all that. So then you ask Tina Bop advice. So I'm going to give you Tina Bop advice. It's the same way with too salty food. If you put too much salt in the food, you can only add water. Then you're going to be eating watery food. Or you can eat it extra salty, but it'll never be the same. Okay, and then you could do like everybody else do and throw it away because the food did not turn out good. And that just is what it is. That's exactly how it is going back or staying in a relationship after one partner has cheated. So, yeah, and that's my advice on that. <sighs> I haven't decided if I'm going to take relationship questions or y'all questions in general because y'all questions be so ghetto. Like, <sighs> And I really be like, I know y'all done heard this before. I know somebody done told you exactly what I just told you about that. So, yeah. But y'all let me know. And we can always talk about it or have it up for discussion and insert it. And just have one question per video or make a podcast ask a question. I don't know. We'll think about it. We'll do it. But yeah, y'all. So, 
I hope y'all enjoyed today's episode. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Don't forget to follow my page. Wherever you're watching your girl, follow your girl. And love y'all. Bye.